Hello everyone, welcome back to the Violet Hour. I'm Bilisium, and today we are continuing with Lost and Random. In the last episode, we helped this lady out, and one other person, and now I believe... Well, Fort Town may have its problems, but it's better than where I came from. It, um, it is better, right? Yeah, totally. Uh... We have one more person that we have to find. We found the red thread. We found the blue thread. Now we need to find the purple thread. And then I believe we will be able to uh, progress the story with uh, Uma. I'm trying to think of her name. Well, I came from one town village with my family along with me. Oh, Fortuna. Oh, gosh. It's stuck. It's stuck in my head. Oh, there, stranger. I've played enough times in my time to see that you could use a friend. I just want to get home. I don't know what I want anymore. Yeah. Now that's the first step, friend. To not know what I want? And what's the second step? Yeah, let's go with that. It's to figuring out what you do want. <laughs> there was a time I wanted to get back home too. Back when I traveled the six wards, singing for my supper, and every night as I took in the applause, whether it was there or not, I think this is it. It's time for me to go back home. And every morning I'd get up and go somewhere new and start the whole thing all over again. But now, of course, I figure I didn't actually want to go back home. Not really, anyway. Didn't know what real long it was till I came here. What's special about Forberg? You don't live in Forberg? No, what's special about Forberg? <laughs> Not a blessed thing. But when the foreman came here, he took over Rockwick. No one could roll a higher number than him. Except for Her Majesty, of course. I refused to play for him, and he smashed my fingers up real nice so I couldn't play for anyone. But, yeah, that's no bother. I still remember my song. They're all right here. You see, in my heart. I'm sorry about your hands. Well, silver linings, friend. Now I can live my days without expectation. Ain't nobody expecting nothing from a man on the street with busted hands. Did you know the foreman's a relative of Nanny Fortuna? That's how come he can keep himself out of jail despite all the heretical dice rolling around here. Hmm. I know her! She's a monster! Does Fortuna make him do these things? <laughs> nah, he is a ruffian, but he is his own man. And well, besides, I'm just sharing a hearsay. Well, would you look at that? I haven't seen one of your kind in years. Quite the charmer, too. But looks like you're a bit worse for wear, if you don't mind me saying. Yeah, the foreman did that to him. I'm gonna find dots to make him better. He says the nanny's a real, uh, unrepentant, swamp-brained, bloob sandwich. No. I'm gonna find dots to make him better. I have no doubt that you will, stranger. I can see it in your eyes. You're not the kind of girl who lets the world push you around for long. You'd think all that power would make the foreman happy, but I reckon now he's just afraid of losing you. He's turned this whole town into a reflection of that. Mm -hmm. And yeah, 
In the middle of it all is a small little dark alley where you can be safe and see the world as it truly is. All that power in the world, it don't mean a thing even next to the people you love. The world's got its fair share of horror, but beauty too. And we just have to do the best we can with the cards we're dealt. I know you'll do good out there. You called me even. How did you know my name? Thank you for being kind without wanting anything in exchange. We're assuming an awful lot by saying that he doesn't want anything in exchange. We don't know. And he does seem to know my name, which makes me think something further is going on here. So, you called me even. How did you know my name? Ah, shucks. An old man like me gets a lucky guess once in a while. Mm. Not even a full man could take that from us. Mm. Glad you're well, friend. Oh, it was a nice moment of fellowship and kindness in a town that had not shown her much. Even was thankful for that. I don't trust you. Superb draw. All these characters that keep knowing who I am, and I'm not sure how they know who I am. Are they working for Nanny? Are they a part of like an underground railroad of against the the uh, queen? And my name is spreading. I'm becoming infamous. I mean, I guess that could be possible. There's lots of people that don't like the queen, and they don't like the nanny, and they don't like the the circumstances which have been put into place. So maybe that's what's going on. Is not just the posters, but uh, people talking. The girl with the dice. The opposition. I don't know. It's a little bit far-fetched, though. Or... A little too far for me to feel like that's... That's on the nose with what's going on. Hmm. Alright. Now I just gotta figure out... Who... Who needs help now? And I know I said I would stop collecting these, but then I used up all my money in the last episode. And now I need more money. <laughs> okay. So I'm back to collecting all of it. That's, that's, that's what I'm getting at. Where I've missed or who I've missed. So we're gonna do a little bit of running around, I guess. You know what, though? Oh, I see it. Oh, it's you. Oh, it's you. Maybe I have another story to tell? That would be awesome. Oh, an area I haven't seen before. Or have I? I'm not really sure. I don't think those doors uh, reopen back up. So I think this is new-ish. Or that area was new-ish. Heard any good ghost stories lately? I don't know, maybe. Let's find out. Heard any good ghost stories lately? Nope. 
Apparently Only not. One more ghost story to go. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. You're excited. Huh. All right. Where haven't we? Better Damn. off when you've got a new card from old Manny Dex, Esquire. Where haven't we been? Oh, okay, so that was her. We went this way. We did the old up and around. Up and around. Here, yeah, mate. This trade card. Oi, mate. I, do like I don't <laughs> have time right now, I'm sorry. I've never been to the Soothsayer District. People disappear in there. Hello, good sir. How are you? We haven't talked to you Hello, in a minute. Even. How's your adventure going? We'll see you around, Seymour. I'm not sure it's an adventure. How did you end up in Forsberg anyway? Oh, Seymour has his ways, even. And not even the queen can stop my wanderlust. I go where I please. Well, most of the time. Truth be told, I, I, I just kind of woke up with no knowledge of how I got here. But it, it's <laughs> fine. It's fine. <laughs> uh, I love you, Seymour. Now Don't do change. You, first? you probably will see me first. You've got one extra eye on me. Is this the one we just did for the lady? No. So this is the purple thread. <gasps> Wonderful. Oh, there's the picture again. Oi, oi. Looking to get an invincibility potion, are you? Well, you've come to the wrong place. I've got cards, though. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a ridiculous character. Oi! Man, that was the man who'd thrown even in the garbage in Two Town. He was a jerk. And even had to help him all the same. Yep. Sometimes you just gotta help people. Even the ones you don't want to help. This should be fun. All right. Old Four Town Gauntlet. The goal of this board game is to reach its end and defeat the remaining adversaries. Sometimes a card will appear spawning an adversary and blocking your playing piece's advance. The card is removed once this adversary has been defeated. If the playing piece lands on this tile, a durability bubble will appear. Any weapon wielded within this bubble will have its durability restored. Awesome! The playing piece is blocked by an adversary. Defeat the adversary to advance! Alright. Pop, pop. Nice. Nice. Oh. Hmm. 
shield. If I use the bombs, where is he? Wait, where am I? Where am I? Where is he? I can't use the bombs on him. Oh, I see, oh, I see. Um, sure, we'll put those there. Oh, actually, we will not use bombs. We will use hammer. And we will pin, pin. That was all too close for comfort. Way too close for comfort. How am I supposed to get you, though? Awesome. Oh, you didn't really give me coins, though, did you? All right, if I throw arrows. I can work with that. I can work with that, and I'll use you to lower the cost of everything. And then... Oh, nope. screwed now, buddy. Yeah. The provoking adversary has been defeated. The playing piece can now advance. Good deal. Sorry, pups. Sorry, pups, pups. Three. Three's not bad. We're gonna pin you and be done with it. There we go. Oh, what did he land on? Come this way, puppy! The playing piece is blocked by an adversary. Destroy mm. the adversary to advance. Hmm. Okay, I'm not going to grab that just yet, because... Whoa. And I can't get to any of that. I can't get to any of those. All right. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, I guess I didn't need that. Okay. Oh, I was getting ready to dodge the bird. I wasn't ready for the other stuff. Hey. Dodge. Papow. Papow. Are you dead? No, you're not dead. Oh. Whew. 
Where's Dicey? The blocking enemy has been defeated. The playing piece may advance. There he is. I lost my dice for a moment. I don't know where it went. We're gonna use the health potion. We're gonna drop the cost of everything. We're gonna put you on hold for a minute. See me again. Thank you for the slow collection of, of crystals. That's all I really need from you. One more go. Come on. You know you want to. There we go. sure what's going to come up ahead. I'm going to put you there. And... Pow pow! A durability bubble has appeared. Yeah, it still works cool. You, you, and that's going to be good enough for me for now. Breakthrough! Oh. The acid got me. Got me! Destroy okay. the adversary to advance. Mm, okay. Thank you for the crystals. Thank you for the crystals. Pepper. Thank you for the crystals. Aha. do some sonic blasts shall we right about right about yeah right about here that's good and then we'll put some bombs here and we'll pin these things Oof. Oof. None 
nonsense. I did nothing to all of those. That was like completely a waste of time. All right. Do I have a health potion? I do not. All right. Can I get you? No, he won't reach there. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, it's gotta be like on level. I see. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Well, in that case, I'm gonna take you out of the game. One less enemy. Woo! Thank goodness. Good. Good. Brilliant. Fantastic, I would say. Throw. Still, still needing some healing. Good. Ooh. Oh, that dodge was not like enough. Oh gosh. He's a little bit easier. The game is almost over, but who will win? I, I don't know. That's the problem. I don't know. Oh, it's not gonna be me if I keep doing that. Throw. Oh, come on. Don't let me die here like this. I'm too young to die. Okay. Let's. Let's wreck some stuff. Like that guy. Incoming yeah. Bombers. I don't know what just hit me, but I don't like it. Whew. Oh. There are bombs. Jeez. Oh. Nope. Wrong button. Wrong button. Too much chaos. I didn't think it was physically possible. Yes. Health potion. This guy. A durability bubble has the blocking <sighs> adversary has been defeated. The playing piece can now advance. Nice. You. 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 And this guy. Um. Ooh. 
Where are we going? I guess we're gonna be going this way. Alright, so we'll just pin you. There we go. Here we go. Now I throw. <sighs> Pin you. I'm gonna use you up and you and whop you. Ha ha. Good stuff, good stuff. Ah! Bomb puppy. You know what? I'll use this. I'll use that, and then I will pin you. That's good enough. Good enough for me. Good deal. Yeah. That's good. Running away. Now the real battle begins. I mean, if you're gonna just let me wallop you, that's cool too. Oh, there you are. My dodge isn't even fast enough. Damn. There we go. Oh, I thought I was going to be dead for sure. Awesome. So we're done, right? All is right in the world. All is right in the world. Come on, Daisy. Let's get out of here. You, Mr. Calling My Dice Lunchbox. You threw me in the garbage in Two Town. From Two Town, you called me a wonner and tossed me aside. I don't know. Do you throw a lot of little girls in the trash? Yeah, we're going with it's that one. You. Of course it is. Uh, oh, this is awkward, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? Hey, Mr. Lunchbox, me mm -hmm. old eye poking friend. 
so I guess you were saved by one or garbage. I didn't want you to die, but that doesn't mean I'm your friend. Yeah, I didn't want you to die. Yes, fair enough, lass. At least I'll always have Mr. Lunchbox. Easy, easy. Hey, uh, after I tossed you aside, uh, you kept on doing things in two town, didn't you? Mm hmm. Then you ended up destroying the big bad royal. Am I right? Mm -hmm. So now the queen's top servant in all of two town is dead. And I'm the one who could have stopped you from entering the town, but sort of didn't. So I'm the one she's going to come after. So I played her. So now I'm here. And life's not great, yeah. And my life started getting worse right after I met you, yeah. <laughs> Man, I don't hate you. Honest, I don't. I want that queen gone. And I think you're the one who's come closer than any of us ever did. And I can tell you don't think much of me, and I guess I don't fault you for that, but I'm glad you saved me all the same. So here, I don't have money, but I do have this lucky thread. I have a feeling you could uh, use all the luck you can get. See you around, kid. Mr. Lunchbox. Huh. Even had helped someone who'd done nothing but be mean to her and been shown kindness in exchange. <laughs> it's always nice when things work out that way. Even if the reward she was given was a um, short length of unremarkable and apparently useless purple thread. Purple thread. This unremarkable and apparently useless purple thread can't help but seem important. No gift is ever useless, no matter how small. In fact, it's usually the small gifts that are the most important. That is what I have learned in my life. Hmm. On the road again. Where is her tent? I thought it was like right around the bend. Oh, it is. It is right around the bend. Ha 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 ha. How silly of me. Oh my goodness. How did I miss you? Maybe because I was looking at the ones in the distance. I couldn't see the gold in front of my eyes because I was staring at the gold out in front of me, past my eyes. Rug Reader's Domain. I like the uh, the needles, the giant needles. They're very cool, very cool indeed. I got you your thread. You can finish your rug now. Can I talk to you? Hmm. Ah, you've returned, young one. How does fate find you today? I have all three threads. Let me see, young one. Ah, the purple thread from your enemy. You have a dice, and you have to decide what you'll do with that power. And you saved someone who'd done you harm, didn't you? Oh, it seems to me, at least in that moment, you thought everyone might deserve a second chance. Hmm? And this blue thread from the two friends, 
Jones. Not a happy story there, with a friendship and a dice both dead. But there's some joy in it too, isn't there? The old dice wielder made peace with his past, and in doing so, found a new motivation for the present. And this red thread from the woman in love. One can never fully depend on someone for one's own happiness. Isn't that true? We can't lose ourselves in someone else. We have to be our own people, no matter how much we idolize someone. Well, enough of that. Let's see what happens when these threads combine. <laughs> Oh, very good morals. Not gonna lie. Ah, look at that. How beautiful it is when the weave comes together. <laughs> <sighs> You're a long way from one town, young one. You are lost, but you haven't realized yet that your story goes on whether you care or not. Look, um, I'm glad you liked your rug. But I'm, I'm really just looking for someone named Uma. If you are so certain that is what you want, look here. Closer. But it's just a rug. I don't see anything. Sometimes to see things as they truly are, we must look within. <laughs> 